which you guys this will help save space on your c drive so many people have nvme drives and ssds as their main c drive now and some of them are pretty small also wear and tear on your c drive is always a big concern for a lot of people so how can we uh, save space on our c drive and also reduce wear and tear one of the ways you can uh, do this is by going to your download section here now a lot of people tend to use their download section for storage and also for downloading files and basically just leaving them inside the download section loads of people have done this in the past and over the years i've seen loads of people including myself as you can see here 266 gigabytes of space taken up in my downloads area this is when i've downloaded stuff and uh, I might want to go back to it at some point and I'll leave it there. And of course, this is going to take up a lot of storage on your drive. Also, by downloading to your expensive NVMe drive, it's going to obviously have a lot of reads and writes to that drive. So moving this to a mechanical drive or some other drive that you're not so worried about is probably the best option. Now I've got a large mechanical drive here. Now you could partition this off to a bit of space that you want to use, or you could just create a download folder like I've done here on that drive. And I'm going to move all of the content from my C drive to my E drive to free up space on my C drive and also reduce wear and tear on that drive because it will now be downloading to uh, my E drive. So let me go ahead and do this and I'll show you where you can do this. Right click and go properties and then click on move and then select the drive that you want to use. In this case, it's E drive and it's the downloads folder that we've created. You can see it listed right here now. All I need to do is apply this and it will give us a warning message and saying, do you want to move all of the files from the old location to your new location? I'm gonna say yes here, and it's basically gonna move everything over for us. And that way, we've just now moved our downloads folder from our C drive to our E drive, and this will free up space and also reduce wear and tear. Now this does take a bit of time, depending on how much data you've got inside your download section. Now you can also say to me that, hey, you might as well just delete all of that stuff and move the stuff in there to another folder on your C drive to wherever you want. If you want to do it that way, that's fine by me, but this is just one way to reduce the amount of wear and tear as well. So moving it to another location is probably the best option. Now, once you open your browser, you're also gonna to wanna to change the download section here. So click the three dots and then click on settings. Inside the settings panel here on the left-hand side, look for downloads. Click on the downloads right here and you'll see the location is set to our original location, which is on our C drive and we don't want that. We want to now click the change button and change this to a new location. And everything we download off of the internet from now on, we'll go onto our larger storage drive, our mechanical drive, and not onto our NVMe drive. And it will just be like the data is exactly where it is. When you click on your downloads folder, it will be still located on your PC in the same section, but it would now have been moved to a E drive, which is going to free up space on there and reduce wear and tear onto that actual drive. Anyway, I hope this video has been helpful. It's just a quick basic video on how to free up space on your C drive and move your downloads folder to another drive. This is really useful for people that don't have a lot of storage on their C drive. Anyway, my name has been Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. Just want to say a quick shout out to my YouTube members. I appreciate the support and I shall catch you in the very next video. Bye for now.